What is going on, everybody? This is Yoshi, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2 Story. Um, I apologize. Something happened, and I had to relaunch the app, so you uh, can actually hear me uh, relaunching the app. I apologize for that. Um, and I also apologize for not streaming the last couple of days. You know, things happen in life, and you know you have to take care of that first. So... Um, but I am glad to be back because I miss everybody. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Um, something new that I added to my overlay is face cam coming soon. Yes, I finally got because I'm very picky. I'm I, I'm sorry about that. I'm very, very picky. And uh, I got a good great webcam i got the logitech brio it cost 200 dollars, but i was trying to get the lighting correct you know i didn't want to give you guys you know something just just to do it you know what i mean so i wanted to make sure that you guys can actually see me and, and you know have a good time that's what i want so uh that's what i aim for so just so everybody knows that okay so let's get right into it this is red dead redemption 2 story um I believe it's chapter 5. Yeah. But I've beaten this game like several times already. So it's nothing new to me. I'm playing this as a good guy. Okay? Alright. Let's get into it. Okay. There's my horse over there. Hey, what's going on everybody? So I see everybody in chat. Spartan Warrior. Chris Chris by Fortnite. Spartan Warrior. Thank you. I'm glad to be back. Uh, I missed everybody. Alright, so what was I doing? Oh, yes. I'm, I'm doing a side mission. Pretty sure... I'm pretty sure everybody knows the side mission. Um, no, but earlier today... Oh, no. Don't Has tell me. Yes, every, everybody understands. Okay, so... Today... Uh, I actually just got back from the shooting range. Uh, I am a uh, fire, you know, I, I do shoot guns. And uh, I was very intrigued on some of the new series that they, ha that they have out. Um, me personally, I like the Glock series. I know they're an ugly gun, but oh man, they're accurate. They're nice. They're fantastic. So, uh, if you can smell me right now, I smell like like gunpowder. I swear, I smell like gunpowder right now. Uh, let me show you guys something. I came here for one one thing and one thing only. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, first. Follow me, girl. Oh no 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 no. Stay. Stay right there. Daddy's gotta go and look for something. I appreciate that, Chris. Chris, thank you very much. Ooh. Oh, that's Catherine? Jeez. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Well, alright. So I didn't lose any honor because of that. Now, where... I forgot where it's at, because I didn't really care too much. I'm trying to find it. Some of you who have played this before, you probably know what I'm looking for. I just forgot where it's at. <laughs> hey blue what's going on um yeah i mean it's kind of understandable but you know back in the day they 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 didn't take that as a disorder you know back in the day they they thought you were like possessed or something so they killed you <laughs> so all right i can't find it i don't know i can't remember where i found it it's it's a chest, and in it is a gold bar and all this other stuff. 
I don't remember where it's at. Usually I know these things. Hmm. Oh well. Maybe I'll come back for it later. Maybe I'll come back for it later. Oh well. Whoa! Seriously? Whoa! Where are these guys coming from? You know what? Where where are you at? Where where are you? Come here. Come here. I can't believe I missed. Come here. You want to have fun? Let's have fun. Come here. Come here. It's kind of like me talking to my dog. Come here. Yes. Shut up. You and I are going for a little ride, buddy. Come on, don't do this. Don't do this. You were shooting at me. What the hell? Of course I'm going to do this. I'm going to take absolute pleasure in doing this. He's a brave weight. Well, that's extra spice added to the pleasure. Let's do it. Let's go for Let me see. I got something very special for you, buddy. Let's go. No. That's the brave weight matching. Where is that? I think it's right here. I think it's right there. Hey, Spartan Warrior, no problem, man. Thank you. Alright. Let's take care of this little douchebag, shall we? Let's see. Oh, I can go right through. You know what? I can't remember where that little place is. I have a feeling it's right here, but let's just see. All right, all right, calm down. Okay, so let's see, is this it? No, it is not it. Hmm. It's definitely not that. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. I'm looking for the little outhouse. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, they keep a lady locked up in there, and, and apparently she's nuts. And, like, she tries to eat you and stuff, so she's locked in there, and, and the outhouse is, like, chained. Chained shut. So, uh, to be honest, she, she, she reminds me of your girlfriend, if you play Resident Evil 7. She reminds me of your girlfriend... In Resident Evil 7. Oh, well, that's definitely not it. Oh, well. You know what? I'm gonna drown you in the fucking ocean. Let's go. Let's walk casually. Oh, and there's a lot of fish here. I feel bad about this. No, I don't. Come on, man. Well, they always say some people deserve to be, uh... Born again Christians, right? No offense, to nobody. Time to clean your sins. There you go. Yes. Okay, yeah. now back to the thing at hand. I lost honor from that? Seriously? That dude was trying to kill me. Oh well. I know how to increase my honor. 
very easily. So I'm not worried. Okay, so time to do the side mission because it's going to really impact the story. In case, in case none of you know, I'm gonna grab the best gun in the game, by the way. The semi-automatic shotgun. The best gun in the game. Alright. And by that, I mean it kills most enemies in one shot. So. Oh, oh you came. You came. You finally came. I came. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank yeah. He's you, sleeping you with lovely, the fishers. Lovely man. <laughs> uh, calm down, miss. Oh, come on. Let's go. We ain't got a minute to lose. They killed her. They killed Miss Calhoun. All she wanted was a better lot for women, and they killed her, those pigs. Who killed her? I don't know. My cousins, probably, or, or bows. Well, you met them. They're animals. Not even animals. Monsters. Monsters. If God had lost all his powers of imagination. Can you... Can you please take me to the train station? Bo will be waiting. Bo, why couldn't he come and rescue you? Well, if they saw me and him together, they'd lynch him and send me off to a nunnery. Or maybe they'd lynch us both. Hey, Dave, what's going on, sure. man? They do so love hanging folk. Where are you heading? Up to Boston. Good. Boston? Yeah, I like oh. you up there. Oh, Come yes, on. they will. Let's go. Of course. Oh, yeah. That one dude that I threw in the lake. Yeah, he's... He's gonna have so much so much fun with the fishes. That's how you create mermans. Okay, let's try and anyway. get you a train. There, girl. So, just like, waiting at the station in the hope you'll show up, or I'll show up to help you show up. He goes to there every day he can, makes up some excuse or other. I said he would see me oh, there geez. one day soon, and today he will. God willing. Well, well, if he's there, that's true love, all right. I've oh, yeah. seen him since the rally. They watch me so carefully, and he's waited. Or... Oh, first, let me t let me get rid of that. Let her say our families won't let us out, and then all Go that business some, with Aunt going Catherine to and my mode. cousins. <sighs> you saw the house, and then Lee Gray and those boys killed. <sighs> so much bloodshed. I You'd think this could be a new beginning, but everyone left alive. They're even more angry. Maybe anger's a complicated thing to let go of. Something good has to come out of this awful, awful feud. That's what I've been hoping. Bo and I have. I hope I'm going the right way. Our Is it going? Oh, yeah, years, yeah, it's going the right years. way. Sometimes I feel like we can't just leave death and, and RDR is and ruination behind us. I'm very and disappointed in RDR online. Again, but yeah. As far as it goes, get out. Don't look back. Make something decent of your life. The reason why I'm so disappointed man, in it is that trying to imitate no. GTA. Which is a really bad there idea on their part. <laughs> First, let me grab this. Let me let me grab this. Where is it? There we go. Rain with us a little, just to the first stop. Fine. There we go. Put it away. Oh, jeez. My sweet, my best Fine, best. shove me out of the way. Oh, hardly a man at all. I'm, in, I, I'm a nobody. <sighs> Sir, how can we ever repay your kindness? Mm, Money. Jewels would do just fine. Bo, Arthur's gonna join us. I think we need the support. Please, could you buy the tickets? Dear Money. We, I'm here for money. Sure. Thank you. We'll meet you on the platform. What business have you got Buy the tickets. <clears throat> Can I have three tickets to San Denis, please, sir? Uh, of course. Holy sh! Those are oh, expensive, hello, man. Sir. Hello, Alden. I hope all is well. Uh, not terribly. But good to see you. Hey. Yeah, D. Uh, I am so disappointed in Red Dead Online. So Excuse disappointed. Me, Get on the 
train. Get your bags, miss. I got this. Come here, Yankee. With pleasure, you goddamn fool. You want to come back here without giving you a whip? You got lucky last night. Oh, jeez. Oh, you knocked my hat off. You're dead now. Seriously? Seriously? Okay. All right. Let's, let's do it for real this time. There you go. Seriously? Oh my gosh. Get down. Yes. Yes. One kick just to end it. Let's do this. Come on. Can, can I shoot him? Should I shoot him? Uh, I'm not I'm not going to shoot. They're not worth it. Almost. All right, hold on. That's good for your future, not mine. I know. Charming to the last. Then again, my uncle used to keep his own half-brother as a slave. So, what do you expect? Good manners? My uncle used to say things were better the way they were when he could rape and kill with impunity and he didn't have to work a day in his life. Both our families. There's good people in this county, but our families bullied them and drove most of them off. Whites as well as People like that are called douchebags, by the way. Well... How to life. Oh my lord. What? Oh yeah. It's on. Well, once that my once cousin. my hat comes off, that's it. It's game time cousins. then. I think they found out about the jewels. Right, keep your heads down. It's always about the money. I swear, it's always about the money. But luckily I got this this time. You down? You're down? Oh no, no, he's not down. He's down. Come on. You wanna you wanna go down? You down? You down? You're down? Who else? Who else? You? You're down. You're down. Boom. Even, even Arthur is laughing. Even my horse is laughing. Look at that. Even my horse is laughing. Let's go. Look at that. Come on. Seriously? Why do we stop? There we go. <laughs> Look. Look at that. He's abandoning us. Old tired, all right. I'll take a look up front. Oh, I'll what a bitch. It out. Damn it, you did run. Remind me to rob your trains, mister. Here we go. Coming through. Get out of the way. Coming through. No, oh, so earlier I was at the gun range. Uh, I am, I am a shooter. Uh, I own several, uh, anywhere from from 22s up to 50 BMG. And let me tell you, uh, I saw a lot of new series today. It was fantastic, fantastic. A lot of them are well worth it. It's a lot of fun because for some people. The only thing they're, they're gonna come closest to shooting a gun is Call of Duty. Um, 
I recommend you go out and actually handle one on your own. I mean, I know that people have like different opinions about them. Me personally, I don't. I love them. And they're fantastic. I, right now, right now, as I'm streaming this, I smell like gunpowder. And I love it. It gives me a erection like none other. So, oh man, it smells so good. I have a beer. I mean, I have my gun on me, but I don't, you know, uh, respectful. You know what I mean? So, and if you look on the screen, you will see face camp coming soon. The first thing I'm going to have behind me is I'm going to have my M4 behind me so that anybody can ask any question all they want. Uh, it's a real M4, real, real bullets, real gun. And oh my gosh, I love it. It's the signature of America. So uh, I am Asian. I am, I am Asian American, but I love my guns. Well, if you're in the Australian Army, you know exactly what I'm talking about. You wake up and you smell that, that gunpowder, that freshly shot gunpowder. It just smells fantastic. I swear, it smells fantastic. It's better than, a, than any freaking erection. I can tell you that right now. For those of you who have not experienced it, I recommend you do it. Okay, here we go. Why have we stopped? It's best you go on alone from here. Mr. Arthur, I didn't know you could drive a train. Neither did I. <laughs> but <laughs> if I'm honest, it was kind of fun. And I did hey, Juan. Us. Juan uh, Super Mario. Relatives, but they would have killed all of us. I can't say that last name, but what's going on, bro? Sir. Oh, no, I ain't. Yes, you are. Here. Oh, yeah. I love that smell. Money, but... These sapphires are worth a lot of money. Old family heirloom. That Braithwaite treasure. I couldn't take it. No. Let's get you off to Boston before any more your relatives show up. That might yeah. be wise. Hey, get a Boston. Mm -hmm. Anybody who has never been to Boston, it's fantastic, north, and I recommend Boston it. Line. They got money. They'll pay you on arrival. That work for you? Yeah, sounds fine. Get on in. Boston, Massachusetts. Hey, uh, it's fantastic. You protection on a journey like this? I wouldn't be much of a stage driver if I didn't. It goes everywhere I do. Hey! Oh. Miss Braithwaite is going to hold on to this until arrival. Well, I appreciate it, Juan. Thank you very much. On account Jack, of your on your Jack is one good dude, and, and I, I, I can you. say he's a close good. You know, he's a close friend. You're so. a fine man, sir. Just get out of here. I'll leave. Yeah! All right, now I'm way the f, f over here. Can I drive the train? I don't think so. At least I called my horse. All right. Let's go. I'm way the F over here. What is that? Oh. Don't... Don't do that, uh, uh, unless you want to. If you're looking for a gun collection, then definitely do it. But if you're not, excuse me, if you're not, then nah, it's not. It is not worth it. Yep. Oh, go to stagecoach. Oh, jeez. All right. So right now, uh, my house is under construction so i'm in i actually turned a guest room into my stream room for the time being uh what i'm doing is i'm merging a room from the top floor because i have three floors in my house i'm merging the room from the second floor to the first floor so that that way i can have oh 
I want to know. Sir, please stop. Oh, I beg you. Oh, no. I'm in bad sorts here. I took a little jolt and have managed to get myself oh, hopelessly no. lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. <coughs> Nah, I'm I sorry, I can't moving. do it. Keep it takes too long. Um, you have a bear at 50, huh? In Australia? You sure about that? Is it like... Like, are you a Australian sniper? Because I know that in Australia, you can't own guns like that. I know that for a fact, because I have uh, friends who live in Australia. They can't even own handguns. And some of them are uh, military. Because a bear at 50, that's uh, in terms of, uh, you know, I'm in no way trying to call you out or anything. I'm just saying, uh, you know, I I know that in Australia they have, you know, it's, it's a different... Uh, It's a different standing in terms of gun rights. In the U.S., you can't touch nobody. No, you, you know we have we have the Second Amendment. You can't touch nobody. You you can own anything, as long as you got the money. You can even own a fully automatic, as long as you got the money. So I'm. Okay, so, okay, so you are a sniper. So obviously in in the Australian military well first first of all i salute you bro and yeah it's understandable if you're in the uh, australian army yes you would be provided with you know things like that i don't I, I don't recall the australian standard issue but you can wake up now. i know that the marines the u.s marines uh the heavier the heavy artillery response unit has the 50 caliber you know because you know it's meant to go after like tanks and stuff but other than that they use the uh oh man i can't even remember the freaking caliber and uh well, oh, what the? Chill out, dude. You got me. You made me crash my horse, man. Okay, so. Yeah, I mean, I, I own a bear myself. I own the, I believe it's the uh, uh, M82 model. A2. Fires uh, 50 BMG. And uh, that thing won't be on stream. That thing, I can't even keep it on the shelf. I mean, the shelf weight limit is like, I don't know, like 40 pounds. And the M82 itself, unloaded, weighs like 38 pounds. So my shelf alone can't even hold it. So, and plus it's long as hell. Okay, so we're gonna do Reverend Swanson. Uh, but what I do have behind me is I have a you know I, you know just 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 to show that I am a shooter, you know, uh, you know you you like to have stuff behind you to, that represents who you are and uh, me I'm a shooter you know what what can I say you know I like I like shooting guns and uh, I have like a little stand that has. 22 all the way up to 50 bmg you know so it kind of lays out you know like 762 i have 556 i have you know otherwise known as 223 i have 9 millimeter i have 40 caliber i have 45 um you know 10 millimeter all of that 357 44 magnum and uh, just to show in a lineup the size per round so I have that behind me, and you know, so if, we, if, we, if anyone has a question or anything like that, feel free to ask. Um, obviously, that's when the, you know, when, when my cam goes live. But right now, I'm still tweaking it a little. I have three lights on me, and I'm trying to figure out 
you know what is good in terms of of a balance i'm very very picky on that stuff so um so i apologize otherwise the cam would have been up a lot sooner but i just didn't want to throw something just to just to do it you know what i mean a lot of people do it it's very sloppy and that's not me so all right reverend what you got <coughs> reverend you okay mr morgan well i was a competition shooter for a while challenging times so for all uh us. for like four years yes, but then i stopped because you, you know you, you you do something and then you figure out hey it's not I've for me so i'm moving on I've you know what i mean morphine, so sir. Arthur, I'm reverend swanson would you excuse us a minute of course New York, we are gonna go to New York. Now they have been. You know, you just try something, and then you find out, hey, it's truly not for me, so I'm gonna move on. You know, that's what happened. New York. So, but I still love shooting. The islands or this place, New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of commotion, and then we disappear. We need more commotion. One score and one whole hell of a lot of noise. We ain't so good at doing scores anymore, Dutch. Are you feeling all right, Arthur? Sure, I'm fine. Pardon me for interrupting. I brought a friend, Arthur. Hello. Hello. Dutch. This is Eagle Flies. His father is a great chief. Charles and I, we um, pretended to be mercenaries. I love this music. Did me a great favor. The flute. Dutch Vanderlyn. Hey, I King Wicked, what's going on, man? Well, sir. Well, I am sorry to hear that. I greatly I'm appreciate it. Thank Father you. Father is confused. Wisdom with weakness. His people, my people. Hey, Tryhard, what's We've going on, man? Too much. Or, sorry, too much. my apologies. Our Insanity, what's going oh. on? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Why? Colonel Favors is a liar and a murderer. His people won't stop until we're all dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting... We will starve. This is another act of war. I see that. Men have helped me before, and I have money. Put your money away, son. What do you think, Charles? You know I told your father I will not fight over some horses. But I made no such promise. Come along. Yeah, Arthur, we must go with them. To try to stop things from getting out of hand. I guess. Come along. Here we go. We can get them hey, horse. anyone who can find me that I understand soundtrack, I, I would greatly them. appreciate it. I've been looking and looking and looking. I just can't find it. The flute. The Native American flute. Well, it's actually a sakuhachi, but which is a Japanese instrument. But uh, I just want to know. I have a man waiting for us there with some canoes. Surely this can be done without killing anyone. Of course. What will be will be. Anyway, son. It always ends up in a killing. What the hell are you talking about? He and his regiment take the pleasure of persecuting us. All the young have been taken from our reservation, shipped off to reform schools. Many women, too. The old are weak and sick, but they deliberately withhold medicine and supplies from us. This ends today. You have my word on that. Yeah, well, we'll see, right? Because usually when he puts his word on things, things always get effed up. Dutch? Shoot fellers as need shooting. We Here we go. Fellers as need saving. Feed them as need feeding. Not this again. It's been quite a while since we helped anyone but ourselves. And even you Ooh. know that. I told you. Noise. We need noise, Arthur. Noise and faith. I still yeah, yeah. don't know what that means. Stop questioning and think. Just think. For a second. Oh yeah, thanks. Pinkertons have had time to reinforce. The civilized world is closing on. Yeah, you hit a tree. Who knows what else Molly told them? 
We need to move towards a conclusion. Now. Sure, but what's this got to do with any of that? Some good, honest conflict between the Army and the Indians might be just the distraction we need. Kill two birds huh. with one stone. Cornwall was funding the Pinkertons' assault on us. Why do you think I dealt with them? With Cornwall gone, the government is far more likely to divert them to other issues, especially if there's one more scandal. And then we can slip away. Like I said, we just need that noise. That's an interesting theory. Score. You know, I went back for the chest I had hidden outside Shady Bell, and we're close, Arthur. That dynamite, the railroad contract with the army, it was all in those papers Micah found. I have a plan. You just have to trust me. You got a round of books. All right, Spine Warrior. I'll see you, man. Where am I going? What? What? Oh. See, that's the messed up part about cinematic mode. It just... it. I don't know. It makes you crash into trees and makes you crash into wagons and... It's a mess. Make sure you have your gun. Yes. There's Peta. Well, to be honest, uh, insanity. I've beaten the game so many times like said, already. This is my fourth run us. on PS4. As a good the guy. Is still moored in the channel. Good. Come on, let's go. I played it as a bad guy twice, got and got thrown out of my camp every single time. <laughs> Try it. Because depending on your honor, you know, the game changes. We need to get it changes depending on how you play. I think the best plan A lot of people don't realize that. The same thing with dialogue. We'll be ashore before anybody even knows what happened. A lot of the dialogue changes because you're a bad guy. You know what I mean? So Arthur, instead of replying very nicely, he's going to be very aggressive. Easy. They're gonna hear us. You know, like right here, you know, Arthur would say, who cares if they hear us or something like that. You know, so the personality of Arthur himself changes depending on your gameplay. So if you're luck. if you are a really bad guy, then Arthur, be you know, he becomes a bad guy, you know. Obviously, that means you get a bad ending, but, uh, you know, it really is great. This is great, so you can replay it over and over again, and it, it changes every time. Knockout. Oh. Thank you, Spine Warrior. I'll see you next time. Warren Lancaster. You mind the horses? I need to smoke. So do I. Oh, no, not again. Gotta sniff a good head all night. I'll be retiring in the morning at this rate. This gameplay, I'm playing as a good guy. So I'm not trying to kill anybody if I don't have to. So. Get out of my way, dude. I'm out. All right. Uh, oh, what the? No, I can't see. God damn it.
Yeah, I shouldn't have ran. I found a body. Damn it. I was trying to sneak. God damn it. Sorry, y'all. I tried to sneak. Uh, you have to move the bodies away. Obviously, I sprinted. So, you know, that's how they saw me. But, um, and then, and then you whistle. Well, I guess I can't do it right now. But if you guys remember that uh, distraction, uh, when you guys did the sneaking mission before you get on the boat and you and you whistled and they're like, huh, what's that? And then they go over and they check. And uh, that's another way of doing it. But then you can't leave the body there. You know, you you can't leave the body there. They're, they're, they're going to see it and it's going to be alert. So you move the body. That's what I was trying to do. And then I, me me being a, being a dumbass, I sprinted. So... That made them uh, spot me. Hey man, if you think that's a good idea, don't trust nobody. Go for it. Jeez, talk about a rough landing. What is wrong with you, Dutch? The boys all right back there? Yeah, I think so. But there's a huge hole in the boat. Horses are spooked, and we're taking on water. The boys, get them out of here. Let's go. Go on. And I lost my hat again. You're quite the best pilot I've ever come across. The horses are confused. We need to round them up. I'll get these four, Arthur. Can you go out with the others? Okay. Come on. Over here. Come on. Did somebody just drown or something? Hmm. Interesting. Let's just see. No, so on the 26th, next week, I will be covering Resident Evil 2 along with several other streamers. So, uh, PS4, Xbox, and PC. So that way everybody gets an idea of what it's like to play on different platforms. And I will be covering the game. It's it, it means a lot to me. So what? Get out of the way! Get out of the way! I'm gonna run you over, or get off my horse. Never mind. Oh, seems like Uncle Sam likes you fellas even less than he likes us. So it goes. To tell the gang what to do. Will one of you help me return the horses to my men? Well, Arthur. Oh. Arthur needs to rest. I will. I like you, son. And after the horses, are we gonna wait for the army to come and wreak its revenge? I hope not. Of course we ain't. Now let's go check out that fort of theirs. Is this a good idea? This is the only idea. And it is one that will suit both of our purposes. Fighting the army ain't wise. Stop worrying. Oh, and Sadie told me about Combe. Meet us at Doyle's Tavern in San Denis when you can. Shall we go, son? Certainly. <laughs> we'll start some light reconnaissance out at Fort Wallace, and when Combs dealt with, you come meet us there. We'll set up a good spot for you. I don't know, Dutch. Yeah, well, I do. This is exactly the distraction that we need. Your father said that fighting was an impossible gamble. There's no winning for you in this. Father need not know anything. He'd rather live in ignorance. Come along, gentlemen. Your father would rather you did not do anything so foolish. I said I would stop this from happening. Would you talk to him? Speak with Rangeful. Yes. 
Would you? Sure. Oh. I'll speak with him. You head on back to camp, check on the others, touch his behaviors. I understand. Thank his behavior is trash. That's what's happening. The hell? Idiot. I know I know I lost the honor, but it's oh, never mind. I got it back. Come on. Come on. Okay. Alright. So where am I going? There's Mika. Oh, don't don't do that guy. You know what? I'm gonna go to Saint De Saint Denis. Saint Denis, here I come. First, I need my hat. There we go. Now that is a real cowboy. All right. So, what? I wonder if I'm gonna run into the Wolf Man. I don't care. I I already tried killing him like yeah. twice already. So, let's see. In this region of Lemoyne, I'm wanted dead or alive. To be honest, I don't care. Because I have a pretty high honor and I am good. As long as that doesn't get hurt, I'm good. Uh, doesn't mean I have to kill anybody on my way there. Why do I hear a pig? What's going on? Why do I hear a pig? Like a hog of some sort. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. So, he just went over that uh, track over there. That's where that pig was from. I swear to God, I thought I thought the horse was making those noises. I was like, wait, horses don't go oink. What is that? What was that? Oh, a snake. I missed. I missed again. I missed again. And I missed again. I still missed with Dead Eye. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. Got you now. Let's see how good you taste. Uh, Insanity, I'm playing Red Dead Redemption 2 Story Mode. Poor snakeskin. Stringy meat. Okay. You keep angry, darling. I like a man. You know what? You get this. Boom! Right in the head. Okay. Oh, what? Come back here. Take me off this horse. Let's see what you have to offer. Let's see what you have to offer. Let's see if you're gonna try to eat me or something. Don't you dare try to eat me. Oh, praise me, you came when you did. <laughs> I don't know what would happen. You just okay. get home safe, ma'am. Yes, thank you. All right, we're good. Hey there. You didn't try to eat me. All right, bye. Yes, that's that, Dan. That's that. That's the way it is. Okay. Now what? Hey. What? Is it the snake that I just... What happened? Wasn't it over there? Oh, well.
usually around here, uh, around like two in the morning. If you camp around here, you're gonna see a ghost of some women uh, around this area. Well, around here, right here, around two a.m. You're gonna see a ghost lady. Uh, let me know if you guys want me to release that video. I actually covered it. What? What is that? Oh, that's an alligator. Let's see if this will kill it. What's the problem? This ain't no better than before. Seriously? What? Okay. Let me see, is there a snapping turtle? Yeah, it's a turtle. Let's see. Crunch, crunch, right? Getting all the insides and everything. Oh, yeah. Sorry, bud. Yep, it's an alligator snapping turtle. Let's put you into the water. Okay, there you go. Just drop you in there like that. Okay. Thank you for the meat. Saint Denise. Yeah. Well, actually, I have a lot of videos. Uh, but at the beginning of November, I don't know if anybody remembers. If you watch my channel, you know, um, people were stealing my videos because it was just, you know, it wasn't branded. It was just a regular video, no brand on it. So people were taking it. And what they were doing was they were deleting my voiceover and they were dubbing their own voice over it and I saw it in too many channels so what I did was I, I actually took down 13 videos um, this was when Red Dead 2 first came out this was like literally six days six days when the game came out you know i showed you how to get honor i showed you how to get money i showed you how to uh you know find all the rare guns everything and what what ended up happening was people were stealing my videos they were taking it and uh you know slapping their logo on it they were they voiced over it but i could tell it was mine you know, because if you watch my video and you watch that video, you could tell that video belonged to me. Um, and when that happened, I took down the videos because I knew people were just going to keep stealing them. And talking to YouTube, they told me that was the best idea. They, they told me to take it down, brand it, and then re-release it. But uh, there are some videos that I have released you know like how to get the shotgun how to get the dual weld how to do all that but uh, some of my other videos I decided not to release them sure it would have helped my channel skyrocket but you know I'm I, I'm not a bad guy so I just decided to you know what I'm gonna take him down so I took him down you know Like, my money. I got 30 grand. I got 30 grand. That's legit. I didn't glitch. I didn't mod. I didn't do nothing like that. This was a legitimate way of getting money. And uh, I actually covered it in a video, but I didn't release it because, again, I took it down. So, 
I was making what two thousand dollars every time I played. So this is story mode. This is not Red Dead Online. Red Dead Online when it, when it was first released, you got paid like two dollars a mission. Now I heard you got paid. You know now I hear that you get paid like twenty, like up to fifteen dollars a mission, which is really good. But when I first started Red Dead Online, it was really bad. Move, lady. Don't you worry about me. There you are. Here I am. Come on, let's go. Let's go where? And why are you so right? Uh, I'm not gonna Today drop names. Because YouTube Today told me not to. to so, uh, I didn't drop names. Uh, so I'm not gonna drop names. Uh, a lot of the videos that were stolen from me are removed. So, um, and they told me do not drop names. So I'm not gonna drop any names. I apologize. Nor would I. Which is why, despite us being wanted men, we're gonna attend the event. Oh, you found it. And follow him onto the scaffold. Well, let's hope not. But if I could see that son of a bitch. Send it to me on PSN, because if you post it on live chat, Nightbot is going to time you out. In this, in this. Okay. Come on. Do you know what is what it's called? Insanity? Well, don't we just look the part? We'll cut through the alley to get to the gallows. We keep our weapons holstered, our disguises on, and our wits about us. Mrs. Adler. Might I say, being a fancy woman of San Denis shoots you. I dress up like the Queen of Sheba if it meant seeing that son of a bitch swing. Cole hung me up, nearly. Oh man, me. she reminds me so much of my wife. Woolen coat. You made it out of that predicament, as I remember, Mr. Morgan. Nightbot does kind of suck. So lucky. Uh, unfortunately, like Streamlabs and Stream Element only work for Twitch at the moment, so you can't use them. They have a far, far more superior uh, chat management bot, but unfortunately, it does not work for YouTube. It only works for Twitch. Whatever do you mean? Are you gonna keep your cool? Really? When you seem to lose it all so I'm on PS4, and I appreciate it, man. Don't we all? You two quit it. We all got a job to do, and we're all in rough agreement about how we're doing it. As far as I can tell. Exactly. We'll get it done, all right. All right then. Come on. We got a hanging to witness. This is one of the greatest moments in Red Dead Redemption 2. Look here. Don't uh, the public love it's great execution. acting by the actor. Because a lot of it is facial capture. You know, just like uh, GTA, you know, a lot of it is the camera pointed at their face. All right. So. Good. Now, you see that pair of assholes? Sure. They're Combs boys. Yes, I think so. What a surprise. I'm glad we're here. What are they pointing at? We gotta follow them and find out. Yeah. Oh, here comes somebody. <clears throat> Stay. Yeah. Uh, PS4 Pro, Xbox One. Uh, I even got PC, so I can cover a lot of the platforms. That horse, officer. Yes, sir. The crowd came to see a show. We don't want to disappoint them. Guess they did miss their chance to see John swing by his neck. Hey, hey, you know I wasn't going to let it come to that. If you want an Xbox, all you gotta do is uh, put in uh, exclamation mark Xbox, and you see my gamer tag. Como Driscoll's going to get his due. He's turned down there. Let's go. 
quiet. What does it look like? A bunch of cops. How many? Enough. So what do you think? Paul's up on the roof. Once he starts shooting, we we'll have to have our wits about us and move fast. Yeah. I guess we faced worse than this before. Sure. Let's get to it. Yeah. So, huh. they got a guy. I don't know why that didn't work. Overlooking the gallows. Oh, never mind. Find a way up there. On one of these verandas. Through a building, maybe. And get him. And do okay. it. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. Well, Thank you, Insanity. I'm going to do it silently. I want to see this bastard swing. Hey, little dog, what's going on, man? Oh, Arthur. Here's a ladder. Yes. Ooh, there's a ladder. Yes, I wonder where that goes. No, it goes downstairs. And stop him. I'll go back to Mrs. Adler. <laughs> okay. Oh, what the? Okay. Am I going the right way? Gosh, I forgot. Oh, what the? Damn it. Alright. You know what? Well, that ain't gonna work. Is it? Oh, get, get down. Get down! What is going on? Okay. Sorry, dude. Wrong place at the wrong time, man. Gallows, gallows. Which way was you? All right. Man, even though I played this for a while, well, I did miss a month. So, what am I doing? Come on, dude. Okay. What's this then? A gun case. I appreciate it, little dog. Thank you. Oh my gosh, what did I just do? It was right there in front of my face and I just and I was like, you know, oh, you know what? I'm going to jump off. <laughs> it was right there in front of my face and I was like, oh my. I'm going to be an idiot and jump off. Yes, that's what I'm going to do. Oh, what the? <laughs> oh, man. Well, third time's a charm, right? I'm sorry, you guys. I'm being, I'm being a little douchebag today for some reason. Okay. Third time is a charm. Let's go. Yay! I'm here! Seriously? There you go. Okay. Bye bye. There goes your escape plan. The only way to deal with him justly is by Don't tell me. Home O'Driscoll is one such. Again, this is a really good moment in Red Dead Redemption 2. He has murdered, tortured, robbed, stolen, raped, and abused for.
Wish I could throw him off. Seemingly with impunity. Today, justice catches up with him. <laughs> As well you may. I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges. This is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Colmo Driscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. This is not a task we take lightly. It is not a task we enjoy. But it is a task we must mm. carry out if our mm, civilization man. is to prosper. Gentlemen, are we ready? Call Modrisco. May God, in his infinite wisdom, have mercy upon your soul. Whenever you are ready. Never knew how it feels to watch somebody you love die. You ruined my life! There we go. Arthur! If you can hear me, shoot some of these old dresses. Oh, I can't believe I missed. He's down. He's down. What up, dude? You down? Where are they? I don't know, if I kill the cops. Okay, so I don't lose any arm from them. Oh, his head is gone. He's down. Where is everybody else? I keep shooting off hats, I swear. Can't can't get that guy. I keep shooting off hats. I don't know why. Oh, damn it. Well, we got him. Let's just get out of here. Go. He doesn't look dead, to be honest. Here we go. How you get on, Arthur? Well, and we saw the bastard hang okay, but the whole thing ain't gonna save us. I guess that's one less thing to worry about. I guess compared to the entire government, in the end, Como Driscoll didn't seem like such a worry. A letter came for you. Oh, okay. I know it's from that Mary. Mary? She ain't worth it, Arthur. Who is? She ain't worth it, Arthur. 
But yet he grabbed the letter quicker than a than a match. My dear Arthur, you never showed up. And now, after looking at the newspapers, I understand why. I don't imagine you'll receive this letter, but I nonetheless must send it. Arthur. Oh, Arthur. I was just starting to dream the silliest and softest of dreams. I miss you, and I will always miss you. But I cannot live like that. And it seems you cannot live any other way. When I'm with you, the world makes sense, but when we are apart, I see clearly that your world is not a world from which one can escape. I'm so sorry for everything. For everything long ago and for starting up that business again. There's a good man within you, Arthur, but he is wrestling with a giant. And the giant wins time and again. You've broken my heart again. And I fear I have broken yours. And for that, I will never forgive myself. But you must let me go now. I enclose a ring you gave me many years ago. When we were both young. Not because I don't like it, but because I care for it far too much and it reminds me too much of you I hope one day you will find some people in love who can use this for it kept me thinking of you all these years and I hope by returning it to you I can finally be free goodbye Mary oh too bad for Arthur sorry Arthur so sorry, but things happen, you know, things you can't control. Okay. Another Eagle Flying's mission? Oh, that's the one with the, okay. And then there's Rain's Fall. And then there's Mika. Hey, Blue, why the sad face? What's going on, bro? Why the sad face, man? friend never better I'm Dutch. trying to eat dude you're breaking his heart you know that no I no tell you to say this to me friend no <laughs> but I know Dutch and that fool at his ear they're gonna kill every last one of us I see that now Bye, Javier. I'm trying to eat, man. Hola. Hello. No, it's not about that. You know, because earlier on, um, he had a girl and a son. So, I mean, I don't want to spoil it for nobody, but, um, so he understands. He, he he completely understands. Oh, my horse has to eat. Here's a carrot. All right now, girl. Here, girl. There we go. Dude, this game reminds everybody of everybody, man. There's so much in this game that everyone relates to. So... Yeah. You know, myself, 
I can relate to a lot of stuff that Arthur goes through. So, you know, you know, when a game has that much of a connection to you, that's what makes the game special. You know, where it makes you understand, you know, the realities of life. That's when the game becomes a fantastic, you know, story. And it is. Uh, Red Dead 2 is a fantastic story. So. I'm going to go to. I'm going to go to Mika. Just because. You know. The. The dude is just been there for a while and his name is starting to irritate me so that's why I'm going to him we will see we will see oh he's at, he's at this house by the way before we do anything let me show you guys something in case you guys don't know I want to hitch my horse why can't I hitch it I want to hit you my horse. Oh well. I want to show you guys something. In case, in case no one, no one here knows. Look at this room, man. Look at that. Inspect. Huh. Oh, because I, I didn't I didn't come here during this uh, play, so. But look at that, huh? It's a beautiful masterpiece, ain't it? Okay, let's move on. Okay. Ah, there he is, old Black Lung Morgan. Shut up. Was you followed? Excuse me? Was you followed? Do you know who you're talking to? I ain't sure. I ain't sure about much no more. All I know is there's law whenever you're around. Is that so? Mm. Because it seems to me that since you've been riding with us, there ain't been nothing but trouble. Stirring things up all the time, getting in Dutch's ear. Seems wherever you is, there's Pinkertons and vice versa. So you better watch your goddamn mouth, boy! <laughs> or... <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy, cowboy. You're gonna do yourself a mischief, way your head. Micah, shut it! He started it! <sighs> Dutch says we is to go on with plans to create a diversion. We gotta get some explosives to blow up the bridge. Keep the army out of here a few days. I think it's a real bad idea. I don't think Dutch cares too much what you think. That's clear. We gotta confuse him one last time. Then he and I will head to Blackwater, collect the money, and help everyone leave. He's got a boat lined up. Blackwater's a fool's errand. Everyone knows it. Even a greedy moron like you. It's Dutch's choice, Arthur. You're just a senior gun, same as the rest of us. Only you ain't well. I'm fine! Then you'll do Dutch's bidding. Which is robbing a stage that's coming from Annisburg full of explosives. Rob a stage. All we seem to ever do is rob a stage, you and me. Not me. You two. I got my own planning to do. You boys got this. Shit. Guess we have. Come on, Arthur. And Cowpoke. Take it easy. You could do with a vacation. Hmm? <coughs> <laughs> Hmm. Can I go over there and shoot him? All right, let's go. Nope. It's too bad you can't do it like an R R D R one, you know, where you can have your your horse poop. Just get on the horse. Poop. 
Are you going to sulk or mount up? Damn it. Marcus says we should jump it as soon as it comes through Van Horn. So you're taking orders from him now? I'm taking orders from Dutch. Same as always. Oh, and I just ran over two, two turkeys. What a waste of meat. Hey, hold up a second. Pinkerton patrol over there. Okay. Shoot him. I think we're clear. Let's head off. So, you were saying? Well, that needed to be done. Right now? With the Pinkertons breathing down our necks? See, I'm starting to think oh, that you've man. gone soft, Morgan. Okay. Let's hold up here. Giving me that? Forget that. Give me my best guns. There we so, go. So, wagon will be coming from that way, down from Annisburg. It'll take the two of us to stop it completely, or it'll never get done. So, I was thinking, you go play dead, <laughs> and I'll take care of him. <laughs> no. I'm the better shot, and you, you're the better actor. No, you play dead, and I'll cover you. I got that. I got that. Oh, that's them coming now, I think. It'll be quite the show. And I'm given the shitty gun. Damn it. There we go. Here we go. This is when the fun starts, right? Or is it a nightmare? I think it's when the fun starts. Oh, it's definitely a nightmare. Right, let's let's go. Get this back to camp without blowing ourselves up. Nice shoot. Back there. Nice drunk plane. Comes natural. Here we go. That's why I always recommend th these gun, uh, the Springfield, and uh, obviously not this, but the semi-automatic shotgun. It takes it takes a little longer to reload and you know go through it, but guaranteed one shot kill, almost 99% of the time. Heard or not? I guess my nightmare is gonna become true. On our right, Arthur. See? It's a one-shot kill. 
Guaranteed. It's, it, it's kind of like having the bolt action rifle, but it's a one shot kill. So. Look at that. It's a one shot kill. Why do you not have this gun in your inventory? That's what I'm saying. I don't recommend this gun. I recommend the semi automatic shotgun, but this works fine. Let me drive. This make any sense to you? It's a distraction. So it ain't meant to make sense. It should to us. It's our plan. You know, I've had or maybe I should have left him to drive, because I'm all over the road apparently. Okay. There's my cup ahead. Great. I'm gonna run into your ass. Whoa. Why did I stop? God damn it. You got it? We got it. Yes, we got it. What's wrong, Arthur? Nothing at all, boss. John, go drive this over to Bacchus Bridge. Get a hidden near there. He really does think Bill, he's in charge. You go on ahead. I need to speak with Arthur. Good work, son. What's going on? Listen, I know we ain't always seen eye to eye, and uh, you find me irritating. And a threat, and I like to annoy you. But right now, I need better from you, Arthur. Okay, Micah, whatever you say. I ain't the bad guy you think I am, Arthur. But I am a survivor. Stick with me and you'll live. Oh, the bridge is probably a two man job. You should probably go help Marston. Why don't you? Like I said, Dutch and I got planning to do for the train. There's a big picture here, Arthur. Trust me. Trust you. I want to put a freaking bullet in your freaking head. That's what I want to do. Okay. Okay, so right here, I'm going to go on a short intermission. Uh, you know, guys got to do what they got to do, right? So, I will be right back. Thank you.
What's going on, everybody? This is Yoshi. Coming back from intermission. I appreciate everybody's patience. Here we go. Okay. What am I gonna do next? I have to travel all the way over here. What is that near? It's near Valentine. Jeez, what is that? Apparently, I'm going here. Okay. Now, what's in chat? What just happened? Wolf dude? What happened? Or did I just run into a tree? Oh. Maybe I just ran into a tree. That was weird. Okay. I, I looked over at Chad and then suddenly I was off my horse. Oh well, I'm not too worried about it. As long as it wasn't no naked wilderness wolf dude, I'm fine. She's good. She's good. Ain't she? Little white horsey. She's fine. What is that? Is that a rabbit? Yeah, it's a rabbit. I don't eat it. Yeah, that's my girl. I gotta eat soon, though, and all that. Let's see. Yes, got it. I gotta eat soon, though, and all that. Okay, let's see. Wow, there's so many rabbits around here. Perfect hunting ground. If you ever want to get your... Hunting... Thing? I forgot what it's called. Um... Yes, challenges. Challenges. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Master Hunter. This. Collect three perfect quality rabbit pelts. That's a perfect place to do it. Annisburg. Go there. Anyway. I want to see what's this thing that keeps popping up on my map everywhere I go. What kind of mail is this? Howdy. Nice to see you. What kind of mail? Right there, sir. Yes. Why? Been some grip going around here, and I just thought, uh, ah, you know what? Never mind. What can I do for you? Muncher, I mean, I made it. I was on the face. Everything was toast. Blah, blah, blah. Who gives a shit? And I don't even know it would be. Um, couldn't ask for anything. Blah, blah, blah. And blah, 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 blah. Okay, so that's the dude, that's the painting dude. Okay, which I can give two sticks about, but anyway, let's keep moving, shall we? Never listen to me. It's like talking to a goddamn wall. Now, what is this? I don't want you to work in that mine no more, okay? Would you rather go back to thieving? You too, all hmm? right? That's I'm providing for my family. Well, you can't provide no. for... I'm not putting on a show for the whole town. Is there a man in this town who ain't a moron? <laughs> He's just scared. Good job's hard to find. A good job? Caking your lungs for a couple of dollars a week? Scared or not? He's gonna ruin us both. That idiot. I love him, and I hate him. Every day, covered in soot, coughing half the night. <laughs> well, that's what happened in... Do you really think Jameson or any of the others give a damn whether he lives or dies? <laughs> well, that's what they used to do back in the day. Okay, 
You know, someone's got to do it, just like today, right? You know, you got someone who goes in the sewer to clean all the shit that's down there. Someone's got to do it, right? So, even today, you got crappy jobs, but... Hey, someone has to do it. Might be uh, below well, minimum wage. It's been a little while, hasn't it? But... What were you looking for today? Someone has to do it. Uh, actually, they can't go at an ending with Sadie and Arthur. Because if you uh, watch the backstory on Sadie... Sadie ah, was married. You know, she was married. It was the uh, Aldrisco guys who uh, destroyed her life. So... <clears throat> That's why. You've kept that and looking as nice as the day you bought She was not well mentioned done. in Red Dead 1. So in my theory, the same thing with Charles. Um, I, you know, I don't want to spoil it for anybody. So, um, yeah. I know what happens to Sadie. To Sadie. I know what happens to Art, to uh, Charles. I know what happens to everybody at the end of the game, so I don't want to spoil it for no one. So I won't be saying anything about that subject. Um, but in terms of Sadie and Arthur, yes, it would have been great. But unfortunately, the thing between you know the thing between Sadie and Arthur is strictly brotherhood and sisterhood. You know what I mean? So. Uh, Nothing to do with them falling in love or anything like that. Uh, Sadie's life was already turned upside down because of what happened. Excuse me. Because of what happened with the uh, O'Driscoll boys. So, uh, that's initially how Arthur and them met. Pay my bounty. I don't have a bounty. Do I? Ah, you're back. What can I do for you? Good on you. Get a fresh start. See, I don't have a bounty. Don't tell me I have to. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. So now, now I can take a ride. Going, going to Valentine. But no, the backstory on, Sa on Sadie Adler, she was very weak in the beginning. Very weak in the beginning. Very, very weak. But as she grew on, vengeance is what turned her into a hard piece of iron. Which I don't recommend for anybody out there. In case you do have a vendetta that you want to settle, vengeance is not the key. Trust me. And that's just that's just the way it is. Hey Inglorious, I didn't see you in there. Uh, I'm sorry dude, I don't I don't give shout outs. Uh, especially if I don't you know if I don't know you man. Non personal, just just the way it is. I can give you I can give you a shout out in Glorious. In Glorious seven uh seven seven seven, but uh I can't your friend because I don't I don't know who I'm giving a shout out to. So Don't take it personal. It's no it's nothing personal. I can use a fella like you. You wanna make some easy money? Come with me. I can't talk you. Fuck off. <laughs> well, I appreciate you trying to joke. It's cool. All right, let's get a meal. Get out of the way, dude. What can I get you? I'm just trying to get some food here, man. Mm. 
I, I, I personally know what lamb fry tastes like. I truly do. And it's freaking delicious. No. Go in there. No, don't get on. The good thing about this horse is that you could you could tell when it's dirty. See that? Watch. Look look at its ass. Look at its ass. Oh yeah, there we go. There we go. Now I got some of you to look at my horse's ass. <laughs> okay. So let's go. Again, I don't do stranger missions unless it has an impact in the story. Um, I played this many, many, many times already. This is my fourth playthrough on PlayStation, and I know exactly what story missions or side missions impact the story. So that's the only reason why during my gameplay that I, when I play a side mission, it's because it impacts the story. That's the only reason why I do it. You done good, girl. Okay, this time give me the guns I want. Just to make sure. Okay. Oh, are they way up there? Oh yeah, yeah, they are. They're on top of the cliff. Because we're push we're putting an ambush. Yes we are. Let's go. So good of you to join us. What's going on? Rebellion. The smell of cordite and integrity. It is a beautiful thing. What are y'all doing? An eye for an eye. We didn't start this, Arthur. They did. We? This ain't our fight. It surely is. Whatever it is you're planning, it ain't a good idea. They want you to fight. Nobody will be killed. We're just gonna trap a few of them in the valley, disarm them, tar and feather them, and remind them to leave these boys alone. You have energy for pranks? Come on, Arthur. Just tweaking Uncle Sam's nose a little. I need you to help me. Here we go. Besides, it's perfect. People will see these boys. They won't notice us, and they'll think we're gone. Everyone will blame everything on the Indian problem, and we'll disappear up the river. But first, we need to trap them in this pass. Help me dynamite up these trees. So... Oh, yeah. You're using them. No, sir. No. Never. But it is mutually beneficial to draw attention to one problem and avail over another. These are good people, but so he's using them. Their situation <laughs> is real complex. We ain't helping them. Sure we are. Come on, let's get this done. He's using them. Let's just be honest. Spool. Okay. Here we go. The patrol should be coming in a few minutes. Okay. Hurry, Arthur. I'll plant the dynamite. You run the wire. We'll keep lookout from up here. I always run the wire. I sent for some of that dynamite you and Bill commandeered in Van Horn. Good work with that, by the way. Bill played drunk. The perfect man for the job. Oh, yeah. So, you 
finally got to see Colm hang. Yeah. <laughs> After all those well, years, hard to believe. I do know Rockstar J. Oh, but it was worth You know, the he's the see? We're uh the guy the that one by one. Uh watches over the Rockstar Social Club. Obviously now he's a, he has his hand full because of Red Dead Online, but to be honest, Red Dead Online has already died. I could tell you that already. I think that should do it. Come on now, quick. Get back up here. Okay. I have no idea what Rockstar's next agenda is going to be. Because I own the Ultimate Edition. So I was one of the first people to play it. I was playing with IGN, GameSpot, all those people. I saw them in my lobby. So I was one of the first few people who played Reddit Online very, very first day. I was there at 6.30 in the morning. I was there. You know, I saw IGN people walk right past me honest being i'm being very very honest i saw ign people walking right past me i saw gamestop people uh not gamestop gamespot people walk right past me huge huge people you know and let me tell you reddit online my is dead to be honest i'm gonna go back to streaming reddit uh not oh, not reddit damn. sorry i'm gonna go back to streaming gta online <laughs> don't it's worry. still a very hot game on thing. twitch there's twenty five thousand okay, streamers Here still streaming it Stay low. it's Stay a hot quiet. game you sure you don't want me to man that plunger arthur no I got it. The funny thing is, it's almost seven years old. From so. your shoulders for a minute. Like I said, we're just going to give them a bit of a scare. There they are. Looks like more than we thought. It's fine. We're only here to talk and administer a little good old fashioned humiliation. Your old dad. They switched my guns? Yes, they did. They swapped out my guns. Like freaking douchebags. God least. damn it. Wait for my lead, men. Everyone just stay calm. We've got the upper hand here. Okay. They've passed the first chalk. Put your hands up. You surrounded. Nobody need get hurt. Your humiliation of us has gone on quite enough. This ain't a good idea. Put Here down go. your guns. You are making a mistake, boy. No. You're making a mistake. Put your hands up, soldier. Take a little humiliation and leave these fine folks alone. Who are you? A concerned citizen. Is that so? What now? We should move. No, 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 not quite yet. Soldier, you and your friends gonna tuck tail and run off? Run! Excuse me? I'm getting bored of this. Your friends fired first, soldier! My father won't be happy about this. They fired first! So... There we go. There we go. Sorry dudes, I don't mean to shoot you off, but just all you're doing is doing your job. I understand. This is bad. You pushed us to this. Take them down. You have been to the wall. This time you pay for what you've done. Damn. One axe move and he's dead? I don't want to loot because, well, well, it's part of the, yeah, it's part of the, 
information on them that'll help our friends with their cause. We need anything my father can use to strengthen our case. I ain't sure much is gonna strengthen your case after this. Huh. You used to lose honor from this. I have a bad feeling about this. Said no so I'm, I'm guessing they must have patched it. Because every time you looted one of them, yes. you lost honor. Some poor fool from New Jersey. These boys ain't the problem. They're only kids. Keep looking. There we go. Shit! Everyone, keep your heads down. We're gonna get out of this. Ah, no! There we go. Uh, one behind us, apparently. There you go. Eat that. Um. Here we go. Uh, there you go that oh he's down already okay and missed there we go there we go right in the face where's peta we're sending riders from the fort we need to leave. But where's Peta? Was he killed? He's alive. Well, that went just about according to plan. I'm trying. I'm trying, Arthur, with everything I have, and I will keep trying, and you'll keep doubting me, and we'll keep failing. It ain't like that, Dutch. Look at me. Look at me! I'm just... I'm worried about folk. I know. I... We should go. Where's Eagle Flies? Run, son! Run! Come on! This area Run, is bitch! Run! We gotta leave. Now! What about Eagle Flies? We gotta go, Arthur! Come on! We Run, go bitch! Hard. Run, Force! Run! Alright, girl. Run, Force! Even though we're on horseback. But run, Forrest! Finally, I can switch guns. Because I don't want that piece of shit. Here we go. Okay, let's dismount here. We won't get the horses down this path. I still have to go. Okay, no, I don't. Okay, foot, try good. and sell them a little snake oil. You think it's all yeah. <laughs> Snake oil. Let's do it. Let's see if we can lose him down here. You're gonna die. I guess not. Get behind something, Arthur. Get behind something. You you shot him before I did. I love this guy. Oh yeah, there we go, oh yeah, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh. What the hell was that? Sorry, man. You and your horse died. But, oh, love this gun. Deadeye to, re to replenish my ammo, and I'm good to go. Man. Oh, man. Let's go. Right in the face. 
Come on, dude. We're being overrun. Get out of here. Well, then get the fuck out then. What are you doing, dude? Officers, you keep them hands up and come here. Put your hands up. Hello, Captain. Keep your hands up and come here. Come here. We, uh, we can't do that. Your man. What just happened? What? What just happened? I've been drinking, so I, was I drunk or? Oh, okay. All right. Sorry. Sorry, y'all. I forgot about that. We uh, we can't do that. I was like, I've been drinking, man. Was I drunk or did that just happen? What the F just now. happened? You're fighting nature, Captain. Get over here. Ask my friend here. My whole life, I tried to fight change. It's a waste. I see that now. It's waste. You can't fight nature, Captain. You can't fight change. You can't fight. And I lost my hat again. Jesus, Dutch, what are you doing? How many hash do I have to go through? You know it costs money, right? Swim to Dutch. is what we need. Oh, we just escaped from chaos. Eagle flies must have been taken. Taken or killed. Well, we can't go find out. No, not now. Charles, I'll, we'll send them. Uh, where is it? <coughs> He's probably back at camp. Let's split up. I'll go tell them. You rest up. Keep a lookout. We are gonna make it, brother. I can feel it. Faith, Arthur. Have faith. You see, when you see this, that tells you what kind of ending you're going to get. I have the deer. That's a real good ending. If you get the wolf or the rabbit or whatever the fuck. You need to step up your game. <laughs> Unless you're purposely going for a bad ending. So. Oh, what the hell did I just do? Did I just tear that down? Yes, I did. Oh my gosh, I just, I just messed up. Oh well, who cares? Let's move on. It's not the end of the world. Okay, so. John Marston. Let's go to John Marston. Yep. Yeah, good girl. 
Good old Mr. Marston. Let me see. If I take the railroad track, will I? Yeah. So if I take the if I take the railroad track, I will I will get there a lot faster, in a way. Unless I fall off, and that's a different story. But I'm not gonna fall off. So. Hey, Retro Gaming, man, what's going on, bro? Uh, I saw your playthrough of Goldeneye. Oh, man, that, that brought me back to when I was a child, dude. I gotta say, you know, a lot of these new gamers don't understand what it was like. You know, multiplayer was on the N64 playing GoldenEye and you had two controllers so I have the most respect for you bro K uh, Kato's Gaming Retro Gaming you're here to support Brohan well I support you man let's get that straight so man I mean, you play a lot of games that bring me back to my childhood, man. There's, you know, no way around it. Uh, you know, you were playing GoldenEye. I, I think it was like a couple of weeks ago. Oh, man. It reminded me when I was still in... I was in elementary school. Arthur, still. Nervous? When GoldenEye came out. And I was playing GoldenEye with... with Friends of mine, of time to think in that jail and, and I feel like I just don't know Dutch. No you know, way. it's not like now where you can, you know, it it's not like Call of Duty. It's not like Black well, Ops. You know, whatever, so whatever the hell it's called. You, oh, I can't explain it. It brought me back to my childhood, man. I just want to say thank you. Kid was good. Retro gaming. Thank you. Yeah, I know. I mean, I love Dutch. He saved me a long time ago. I feel like in San Denis, when I got arrested, maybe he could have done something. I feel like you should take your woman and child and get lost. Do you? You can... You could give something to Jack. Hey, Stider. Well, I don't see no way out of this. Well, what about loyalty? Be loyal to what matters. What are you going to do? I'll be okay, but do it for me. It would make me feel good, if that makes any sense. A little, but listen to me. When the time By the way, I just want to say, if you have a low honor, Arthur would say something different during this cutscene. But if you have high honor like I do, he says that. It will make me feel good, if that makes sense. If you have a very bad honor, Arthur will say something different. Just so you know. Time comes. You gotta run and don't look back. This is over. And now? Now we gotta help Dutch give the army one final tweak on his nose. <laughs> yeah, come on. Help me with the rest of this. Well, it looks like we finally found our calling in life. Let's ride this thing out onto the bridge. There's a spot about a third of the way across where we can get down underneath and plant the charges. I've already set up the detonator. Sure, let's get this over with. You hear about Dutch and Cornwall? Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. More enemies, more chaos. Okay, so this is the part where I don't really understand. Okay, so apparently you press, uh, you hold X when sure he goes up. 
This is my multiple playthrough, but I still do not understand this part. So I apologize if I fail this part many times. I'm sorry about that. There's good. Lower down. Okay, start lowering it down. All right, take it slow. That's not something we want to drop. And okay, good. Grab the other one. Jackknife, man, what's going on, bro? Welcome to the live stream. And be prepared to watch me fuck up. Because <laughs> I played this many, many times before, and I still suck at this part of the story. Because I this is the only thing that I do not understand. So, for everyone in the chat, I apologize if I fail this. Okay. It's because I do not understand. Bridge is wired to the detonator. I just don't. To I'm sorry. Each of those bundles to the fuses. There's one on each of the main support beams. Okay. I sure hope this is enough to blow it. These are mine in charge. They ain't easy to come by. If they don't do the job, nothing will. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. Those of you who have who has not played this before, you will understand what I'm talking about in a minute. Just give me a minute here. Let me put up this bomb and then I'll get right to it. No shit. Train! Arthur, get up here quick! Yeah, I'm on my way. Faster, buddy, come on! Shit. Arthur! A train! Come on, quick! Pump this stupid thing! As hard as you can! Let's go, let's go! Oh, I actually got in the first try. Oh, man. Okay. I guess I really do have a hand in it. Okay. Never mind. I apologize for everything that I just fucking said. That just ain't how I want to die. Come on. Let's go blow this thing up. Um, I think the line held. You want the honors? Sure. Sorry about that. Woo! Here we go. I guess old Dutch got all the smoke he wants. Well, let's hope so. You really think that that'll draw attention away from us? I can't. 
guess we'll see. Tell the truth, I ain't even sure I fully understand Dutch's plan with all this. Like I said, John, when the time comes, you go. What about loyalty to, to everything? You've been loyal. I've been loyal. Look what that cost. You know all that ever mattered to me was loyalty. It was all I knew. It was all I ever believed in. Well, not anymore, John. Soon, you gotta go. Go. Don't look back. I'll think about it. I've done a lot of thinking. Look at us. Out here risking our necks and for what exactly? For an idea that don't work no more. How you mean? You know just what I mean. You got a family. You need cash. You need to start building a life for yourself. Me? I need a vacation. And Dutch has all the money for safekeeping. You know something? Abigail thinks she might know where some of that money is. Well, you tell her she better make sure. And then come talk to me. And we'll find out just who and what we should be loyal to. Ooh, that's a hard one. I don't know, Arthur. Nor do I. But I'm seeing things that like is a now. hard one. I wish things were different. But it weren't us who changed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's too bad for Arthur, man. We gotta get up and be a man about it. Come here, horsey, horsey. Where are you? There you are. All right. We're going into bear territory. Let's see. Let's go. Go up a little bit, turn left, and blah, blah, blah. Okay. Watch this dude. Let's just see how well this turns out because I'm going into a place that weapons are forbidden. So, no, so next week I am doing a cover of Resident Evil 2, and I have a couple people joining me. In terms of a circle of people who are streaming Resident Evil 2, we're all uh, small streamers, as you can see. But um, I definitely would like everyone to be there because I want to try to get my cam going at that time. So if you want to see how I look like, that's going to be your opportunity. Okay, so let's jump off here and go through here and let's see what happens. Hello? Come in. <coughs> you 
You don't sound very well. I'm not. I'm... I think I'm dying. Hey, Wade. I What's going on, man? Peace. I don't know too much about peace. Apparently not. Thanks to that raid you carried out with my angry son, he is now in jail. Apparently awaiting death. Um, I'm sorry. I suppose I lack the grandeur of a conventional king. I don't know too many kings. <laughs> Colonel Favors. He has already exacted some measure of revenge for the raid. Two women were assaulted by his men. Um, I'm very sorry about all of this. Yes. Sometimes the correct path, the bravest path, is the least obvious and also the gentlest. I'm... I'm a great disappointment to my son. Your son seems to want a war. My son thinks there is glory in death. Maybe he's right, but for me, I saw death being handed out so freely by the most foolish of men. I never could equate it with victory. Glory has come in service. Maybe. Maybe not, I don't know. I've killed a lot of people. For a whole lot of dumb reasons, and I ain't never seen much glory in it. Well, your friend, Mr. Vanderlyn, he talks a lot. I don't know him, but my son is easily lit. I'm not sure I get you. Uh, well, perhaps we could go for a ride. I'm an old man. My whole life I have tried to bring peace. But I ain't doing so good. Then maybe you can take pity on my plight. Please, it won't take long. <coughs> and maybe I can help you with that cough. Sir! Hmm. I'm glad I caught you, sir. Captain Monroe, do you know my friend, Mr. Morgan? No, sir. I don't have the pleasure. Arthur Morgan. It's an honor, sir. How can I help you, Captain? I was just in San Denis. I spoke with the mayor. It's not good news, I'm afraid. May I ride with you for a little? Of course. Follow me. So where are we going? I want to show you a site up in the mountains that's long been sacred to me. A place for reflection and healing. Coming past. Okay, sir. What is this news, Captain Monroe? Yes, sir. As I mentioned, I did speak again with the mayor and the Bureau of Indian Affairs in Saint Denis at length. But regrettably, it appears the oil company has already received approval to move forward with drilling on the reservation's land. I suppose there's much. So what does that mean for us now? I'm not sure just yet. I didn't get the impression anything would be happening for a few months. I'm very sorry, sir. I did everything I could. I know, Captain. And I assure you I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? I would rather certain actions were taken by friends outside the tribe. Sure, I can help. That's good news. Thank you. Come meet me on the reservation whenever you can. Even just a couple hours of your time. Oh yeah. Anyway, gentlemen, I won't take up any more of your time. I'll see you both soon. Sure. Thank you, Captain. Enjoy the ride. See? What's left of that bridge over there? I heard about it being destroyed. Do you know if that was also my son's doing? No, I'm pretty sure he had nothing to do with that one. Well, I fear they will find a way to blame it on us anyway. We'll continue on this way. I'm going to look for some herbs to give you. See the wolves over there feasting on that horse? Brutality and beauty are both all around us. Yet so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Yeah! Come on, get out of here! Good. There was no need to harm them. Easy. 
life lesson, man. True fact. You can talk if you want, Mr. Morgan. But don't feel like you have to. It's a beautiful ride ahead if you need some time to think. How much do you know about Dutch? A little. Mostly what Charles told me. Well, for years, he was the best man I knew. But... He's been unraveling for some time now, and... I ain't sure there's any going back at this point. It took a long time for me to learn that you could never change a person. Sorry, uh, hold up a moment. That'll have to wait. Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Ah! looking for English mace too bad there's no more okay let's continue on anyway you were saying it took a long time for me to learn that you could never change a person we only become more who we really are perhaps you see that with him just as I see it with my son. Dutch has got this crazy plan that if we create enough noise and chaos, we'll be able to escape and go somewhere far away. No one will find us. Eagle Flies got caught up in that. Now he's in jail. Sadly, Eagle Flies was ready to fight. I'm sure Charles will find a way to help him, but I just wanted you to know the situation. Well, I appreciate you coming to me, Mr. Morgan. Let me give this some more thought. You know, I had a son once, years ago. Don't talk about him much. No, oh, what was his name? Isaac. His mother, Eliza, was a waitress I met. When she got pregnant, she, she knew who I was, what my life was. I didn't want to promise nothing I couldn't keep, but I said I'd do right by them. Every few months, I'd stop by there for a few days. Hey, Cage. Wait, stop. Uh, no, I wouldn't say it's really for beginners. It's, um, you know, because there's so many ways you can play this game. And right now I'm playing it as a good guy. Different cutscenes, different side missions occur depending on the way you play the game. And right now I'm playing as a good guy. So I'm getting all of the good missions, there, all of the side missions. The dialogue itself in the game changes. So it tastes awful. But it'll help. So that's why I say, you know, if you've beaten it before, play it right, play go. it again. It's done much further now. So you it's were different. Just talking about something. He was such a good kid. She was too, I guess. <laughs> Just a kid, 19. Oof. What happened? I got there one day and saw two crosses outside. I knew right away. Turned out some bastards had come through. Robbed them and shot them dead. And offered $10. It hardened me. Feeling that kind of pain. But I know now that you don't get to live a bad life and have good things happen to you. I think you're being hard well, on yourself. The mission Maybe. is something All that you can, can actually now, implement into real life. Right. What it teaches you is that. Here, hold on. What it teaches yours, you but 
is that no matter how ugly the world is, there is always a light. I'm sorry to hear that. This situation where that's what the mission teaches. It, you know, like Arthur is sick, his, his son and his wife died, and everything. But just because of that, it doesn't mean that you immediately turn into a bad guy. You know what I mean? You know, I'm talking real life here, not about gaming. And there's a lot you can learn from the game. That's why the game is so fantastic. Because it reaches out to so many people. So many people can relate to the game. Um, you know, more and more video games out there are becoming more and more like movies. You know, and... It's just up ahead. The game, in, in terms of the old days, is so accurate. A lot of historians can tell you that. The Pinkertons to the Indians to everything. It's so accurate. I need to find the Chinupa. Who, who would do this? Someone who wanted to enrage you. Help me look around, please. The Chinupa is gone. Of course. What is it? A uh, ceremonial pipe. There must be some clues to what happened here. Kentucky bourbon. I cannot believe this. Army flask. Whiskey. <laughs> Bastards are having a party up here. This is a place of peace. An empty bottle of whiskey. Well, if they drank all that, they couldn't have gotten too far. Yeah, well, still no sign of the Chinupa. Oh, the name of the mission? I have no clue, man. Uh, this, it all has weird names. I can't, I can't say. Oh. I was gonna check, but give me a second. Range fall over here. He's right there, man. Think I see an army camp. Oh, there they are. These brave seriously men. Some of Colonel Can't Fairley's see nothing. Men. They must have been the ones who did this. Are you surprised? What am I doing? Look, looking at a rock? Not at all. But, but I hope we were past this. Well, you got land they want. Land with oil. They moved us here. They've taken everything we had. Oh, yeah. I signed three treaties myself, and they... Okay, so yeah, it is. It's that's that's the title of the mission. No, they've taken the last hope. No, my people are we'll going to want a war. A war they can't win. Not if I get it back. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get it back. Get it back. Yeah, I'm gonna go in, get your chin up, and no one will be any the wiser. Would you do that? Well, you can't go, they know why you'd come. I, uh... Don't have any money. No, I don't need your money. I don't need your money. Okay, let's go. Let's see if they have our sacred items. Oh, 
all but nothing but handguns. Let's go. Oh, give me one second, y'all. I'll be right back.
All right. I apologize for that. I had to take care of something real quick. Uh, I'm going to finish this. And then, unfortunately, I'm going to have to go because business calls, unfortunately. But I will be back later tonight. I don't know if I'm going to stream Reddit online just to give it another shot, which I kind of which I highly doubt. I'm thinking about doing a GTA stream later tonight. So we'll see what happens. Okay. I appreciate everybody for staying this long. Okay. Oh, I lose honor for that? Jeez. See if I can knock him out. So you don't lose honor for that. Huh. That didn't work? Okay. What's that? What's wrong with this horse, huh? I think it's oh. also one. God damn it. Sorry, but all right. See, I I could have came here and just got it. <clears throat> Dang, the whole thing fit into his pouch. Come on. Well, again, I'm thinking about doing a stream later tonight, probably a little later. Uh, my time is Eastern Standard, so it's um, 
almost 9 30 for me so i'll definitely maybe do a little sh to do a later stream maybe like G i'm thinking GT gta 5 that's what i'm thinking i haven't done a, a gta Here. online stream in a while things, i think yes thank you i'm very sorry about this even sacred things are only things people the heart matter more was anyone hurt yes it's a bad business i should not have let you do this for me but perhaps it will stop a bigger massacre with these Maybe I can calm my people. Maybe I can calm my son. I hope so. Thank you. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. Thank you, but thank you. He's a man who, not so long ago, I would have found weak and pathetic. Now I see as wise and thoughtful and sensible. And I would love to help him, or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do something real stupid. Okay, y'all. So I'm going to end the stream here. And I will be back later on. Highly likely a GTA Online stream. With my good bro, Young Ken. So look forward to that. And until next time. Arigatou gozaimasu.